Hello everyone, welcome back to Rosie Maths class. Today we shall discuss question number 5 of exercise 1.4, chapter 1, number systems. Rationalize the denominators of the following. Rationalize means to make the denominator into a rational number. In simple words, to remove the under root sign. The first one is 1 over under root 7. So we need to remove this under root sign. So that is called as rationalization. To do this, we will multiply the numerator and the denominator by root 7. 1 by root 7 into root 7 by root 7. So 1 into root 7 is root 7. Root 7 into root 7 is root 7 squared. This and this cancels out, so we get a 7. So that means... 7. Just remember, whenever we multiply any number, any under root number, say root a into root a, we would get the answer as a. This under root sign cancels out. Second one, 1 by root 7 minus root 6. So here we have two terms in the denominator. So we need to multiply by the conjugate. Conjugate means we would have the same number but change the sign. So this equals to 1 over root 7 minus root 6 into root 7 plus root 6. So root 7 plus root 6. In the denominator also root 7 plus root 6. So this is the conjugate of root 7 minus root 6. Simply change the sign. So 1 into this would be same thing, root 7 as root 6. Here we will use the identity because see root 7, root 7, root 6, root 6. So identity that we are going to use is a plus b into a minus b is equal to a squared minus b squared. So this we will write as here root 7 is a, root 6 is b. So root 7 squared minus root 6 squared. We know that when we have under root and squaring it cancels out each other. So that equals to root 7 plus root 6 divided by 7 minus 6. 7 minus 6 equals to 1. So denominator is 1 which we don't need to show. Answer is root 7 plus root 6. Third one, 1 by root 5 plus root 2. So here again we have two terms. So we will multiply by the conjugate that is root 5 minus root 2. So 1 over root 5 plus root 2 into multiply both numerator and denominator root 5 minus root 2. So 1 into this would become root 5 minus root 2. And here again we are going to use the same identity which is a plus b into a minus b equals to a squared minus b squared. So here a is root 5, b is root 2. So root 5 squared minus root 2 squared that equals to root 5 minus root 2 by 5 minus 2. So the answer is root 5 minus root 2 divided by 5 minus 2 is 3, 3. So this is your final answer. Question number 4, 1 over root 7 minus 2. So here we have a root sign here, we don't have a root sign here. But then we need to use the same method, multiply by the same expression with sign change. So that would be 1 by root 7 minus 2 into root 7 plus 2. Here minus is there, so plus and the denominator also root 7 plus 2. 1 into root 7 plus 2 is equal to root 7 plus 2. And here the same formula we will use a squared minus b squared formula. So root 7 squared and here 2 is b. So minus 2 squared that equals to root 7 
plus 2 divided by 7 square root and square cancels out minus 2 into 2 is 4 so 4 equals to root 7 plus 2 divided by 3 and this is your final answer so all you need to do is just take the same expression and multiply it with the opposite sign minus is there multiply by plus plus is there multiply by minus and use the identity a plus b into a minus b equals to a squared minus b squared that's all for now see you in the next video